Hello, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I have chilling story to share with you all. It's about my experience playing with a Yuja board. And let me tell you, it's something that still gives me goosebumps to this day. So grab a blanket, turn off the lights, and let's get it. First, it all started one stormy night when my friends and I decided to try something new and exciting. We brought out the Ouija board, lit some candles, and sat around the board, not really knowing what to expect. The plane just started moving on its own, spelling out words that sent shivers down our spines. We thought it was just one of us playing a prank until things took a sinister turn. As they continued to ask questions, the air around us grew colder and the candles flickered violently. The planchette moved rapidly, spelling out ominous messages that seemed to be coming from a malevolent presence. We were petrified. We couldn't bring ourselves to stop. Suddenly, a loud bang echoed through the room and, the, and the, the candles went out, plunging us into darkness. We heard strange whispers and felt a cold hand brush against our skin. Panic set in as we realized we had unleashed something beyond our control. The room filled with an eerie energy and we knew we had to end the session. We said goodbye, but the planchet refused to move. It was as if the entity we had contacted didn't want to let us go. This desperation took over as we frantically tried to close the connection, but the entity's presence only grew stronger. To this day, I can't fully explain what happened that night. Our Ouija board experience was unlike anything I had ever imagined. It taught me a valuable lesson about the paranormal and the dangers of dabbling with unknown forces. First, if you ever decide to play with the Ujo board, drink carefully and remember, not all spirits are friendly. Thank you for listening to my story. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more chilling tales. Stay safe, and until next time, this is Sarah Gallagher signing off. Goodbye, everyone.